and Mihu haven't exactly taken position as of yet. Deep smoke toward Ivy, however, is quite clever because that'll give them the position to walk in and focus on the close angles, the immediate threats. Chris J gets the first kill of the round. Snotty's pushed up as well. Down goes Bialy. Neo needs to get the ball back. He's done at least that. He's going to retreat, get back up the ladder and work with Snacks because Snacks is the one that now holds all the cards. He can sway this entire round. One quill kill deep inside of the site. Pasha lurking on the AWP is going to make this a highly more possible round for VP. Bomb to be planted. And the rotations to come in. Two from CT. One from Z Connector. It's Oscar that's now got high ground snacks to back off. No need to get aggressive this time. They need Pasha to rotate over as well to be in the mix. The AWP to get position on the lower ramp. And in they go. Stick out to sneak up. Snacks needs to be perfect. But one on either side. Chris starts it off. Still the hold. Pasha wants to walk back down. Bomb is ticking. They tap it once to try and pull the remaining two players in positions. And they've got them both. It's Mouse Sports that's going to get their second win in 2018. What a grand final it turned out to be. It goes all 30 rounds. The Mouse Sports deny overtime. Great play from Chris J with the AWP to close things out. Fantastic performance from VP. We can take nothing away from this tournament map. They have to be very happy with themselves. They took down FaZe in the semi-finals, but it wasn't quite enough. The third and deciding map was an absolute thriller. But unfortunately, they will go down and the second championship for Mouse Sports. And Virtus Pro did everything they could to get back into that. Running it to B. Snacks was so far forward. And how close they came on 14-10. What a battle back for Mouse Sports. First time they've been in a final where they're the favorite. And they'll prevail. Hats off to Virtus Pro and hearts out to them as well. A battle back in this entire event. Beating Phase 2 oh, no easy task. And they did so this morning just to stand on this stage. Mihu, the undisputed MVP of that game, has certainly made his presence known on Virtus Pro. And hopefully it continues to go upward and onward for that team. But before the future sports champions, Mouse Sports in 2018. Ladies and gentlemen, the V4 champions are Mel Sports. Uh, Chris, I just want to grab a, a few quick words. You like making it tight, these finals, don't you? Yeah, yeah I don't know. Uh, it, uh, it felt really hard to gain control this game. I mean, first map went okay, but second map, obviously, they totally destroyed us. And third map, it was multiple points where it felt like, okay, they're going to start winning now because they won eco rounds, they won other important rounds. So, yeah, it was, it was really, really hard. What's it like coping with all this pressure then? How do these, how do these boys stack up in the grand final for you? Well, they're coping with the pressure really well. Uh, I think I'm the only one who gets like really tilted and rages at... Chris J, he tilted? No yeah. way! <laughs> yeah, it happens, you know, and it happens often in important games, but my teammates are doing really well, so I'm happy about that. All right, good stuff. Does anyone fancy picking up 40 kilos right now? No, yeah, I'm being told no, I'm being told no. Yeah, right, okay. All right, uh, ladies and gentlemen, one more time for your champions of the V4 Future Sports Festival, Mel Sports! And there we are, Mouse Sports against all odds.